Hello, hello, hello. Hey guys. Happy Valentine's Day. Hey Bev, how are you? Hey guys, how you doing? It's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. So tonight we're gonna whoops. Right, mute that. Happy Sorry. Happy Valentine's Day. Sorry, guys. All right. So tonight we're going to make this Easter sign. It says Easter Bunny, coloring egg, spring, hop, 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 hopping down the bunny trail, happy Easter, chocolate peeps and jelly beans, and egg hunt. Hey, Darlene. Hey, hey, hey. All right. So how is it going? So I'm going to do 21 inch poofs. Hey Elizabeth. Hey Laura. Hello, hello. How's it going? All right. <clears throat> so I'm going to do the poof method. Hey Gail, how's it going? Thank you, thank you. Hey Darlene. Hey Annette. How's it going? Hey Melanie. Thought I would just come on a little bit early tonight. So, all right. So I have my handy dandy mesh roller here. You guys know I love my mesh roller. I love it, love it, love it. I got my new um, dowels today that hold smaller, like the 50 yard rolls of ribbon. So I love that. Hello, everyone. So we're going to start on the bottom. This is 21 inch fuchsia mesh. Hey, Linda. How's it going? All right, we're going to go ahead and start. I did get my hair cut. Yes, I did. Let me get a straight edge here. <clears throat> cut that off. Hey, Sandy, how's it going? All right, so we're going to start down on the bottom row. And get going. Hey, Linda. All right, you guys know I don't put ribbon in my, um, whoops, I will use that again to open it up. Hey, Bessie, how are you? So I'm going to do um, 10 inch poofs. Pull it up. If you guys could share this video, I would much appreciate it. How was everyone's Valentine's Day? Hope it was good. Hey, Kim. I know, right? Hey, Pat. Hey, Sharon. Yes, I did. I made my work wreath. Yep, I always make my work, work wreaths. Oh, well, thank you, Linda. Anything that makes me look younger, I'll take. <laughs> I will take it. Thank you so much. Oh, thanks, Shirley. Yes, everything's going well. Can't believe it's Valentine's Day already. Going fast, going fast. Well, I wish you all a happy Valentine's Day, and thank you for coming on with me. So we're going to do the poofs on, and then we're going to do... Um, <gasps> you're in an... Air cast? Oh no! What did you break, Darlene? Hey Nicole, how are you? Thank you. Oh, you poor thing. Well, at least it's just an air cast. Oh, that's terrible. Anytime you fall and break something, oh yeah, 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 yeah. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, Sandy. Oh, man. That does not sound like fun, Darlene. Not at all. Hey, Kathy. Happy Valentine's Day to you. Kind of spread these out. So we're going to do this poof method, and then I'm going to do 10-inch curls on top of them. Yeah, that is... Whew, 
no fun. No fun at all. Yeah, for those of you who didn't see, I finally finished my sister's wreath up there. Thanks, Linda. How are you? I'm going to make an Easter wreath. I don't know, I'm into Easter lately. <clears throat> oh, no, Laura. Ugh. Oh. I know, I'll tell you. I don't know what age you guys are, but I'm 55. And when you get to a certain age and you fall or whatever, you just, you're so scared because you don't want to break something. Oh, man, it's scary. Hey, Christine. Well, welcome. I'm glad you're here. If I have any new members, hey, Anita, how are you? Ugh. Um, if you do not receive alerts and would like to get an alert when I go live, just type live in the comments. You will get a message from my bot. And then, I know, right? 50 you do. You start falling apart. And you do have to respond, follow the directions that my bot tell you to do. And then um, you will get subscribed to my alert system. I also have a group if anyone is interested in joining the group. <clears throat> Typing group. Hello, Elizabeth. Oh, I don't know about that, Colleen. I feel older and older every day. Thanks, Barbara. Same to you. Oh, thanks, Bev. So... Oh, Nicole, no way. Hey, Sandy, how are you? I'm telling you, though, you do. When you when you hit 50, you just start falling apart. Oh, see, you're still young. Oh, I hope not too, Laura. Hey, Terry, how are you? All right, so we're going to spread this out. This is a 14-inch wreath form from the dollar store. I like to make my own. I don't know. I'm just weird that way. Well, <laughs> I don't know. I swear sometimes I feel like I'm 65 or 75. I don't know. Um, No, Pat, you don't have to. No, there's nothing special. It is a paid group. So you, it's a $14.99 a month. So if you type in group, and you want to join, follow the directions from my bot, and then it'll take you to PayPal, where you set up the um, monthly payment. Hey, Maddie, how are you? Um, I think this week we're going to make a tulip carrot on Tuesday night. All right, so I'm done the bottom row. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move to the top row. I'm just going to take it and open this up. And just move it to the top. I'm not going to pull on that. <clears throat> okay. Then I'm going to do the 10 inch. I don't know why I start at the bottom. I always usually start at the top. Hey, Cheryl, how's it going? <laughs> Darlene, right? I know. Hey, June. I always start at the top. I don't know why I start at the bottom tonight. But yeah, we did a um, a Zoom call on Tuesday night, this Tuesday, and one of the members just got her pro bow, so we made some bows with the pro bow, and then um, I showed them some stuff. The uh, mesh roller, hold on, I'll give you my link to that. I love my mesh roller. If you guys don't have one and are interested, it is awesome. Um, yeah, this is my affiliate link, so I do, you know, make a few pennies from it, but not much, but that is my affiliate link for that. Oh, yeah, Christine, I have, um, I've done a couple videos showing you guys how to make your own, um, work wreaths. If you need help finding that, just um, let me know, and I can send you the link later to the video. 
Thanks, Gail. Yeah, it's really pretty, pretty pink. It's a fuchsia. <clears throat> what I like about this mesh roller is, number one, it'll hold three rolls of 21-inch mesh, or it'll hold six rolls of 10-inch mesh. But you can, you know, if you're cutting mesh, you can pull all of it at one time. Yes, I love this caddy. Kimberly, yeah, I got it from Michael's. It was 50% off. It was like $25. Okay, so one more here. Hey, Carl, how's it going? All right. So I think that looks pretty good. I don't think I need to go around again. Um, we're going to do... You guys have seen me. If it's it's if if the mesh is really um, thin, I'll go around again. But I don't think we need to do that with this. All right, so I'm just going to zip tie this onto the frame. It's not necessary, but I just kind of like to do it to kind of make sure it's not going to go anywhere. But it usually won't. Okay. How's your room coming along, Carl? And then I'm just going to tuck that under so it doesn't scratch the door. And then I'm just going to make sure my poofs are all spread out. Okay. Looks good. All right. <clears throat> Oh, Carl, you're going? Oh, my goodness. I'm so jealous. Well, you'll have to do a live from there. I did have a good day in Philly. I brought home some good stuff. Some ribbon I'm going to be selling. So, I have to get all that in order. Got some new um, linen colors in and some really pretty stuff. So, awesome, Carl. If you guys haven't checked out Carl's page, Carl, you can put a, um, your, the name of your page here if you want. So that's the base. This is, yep, a 14-inch 14 wreath um, oh, frame from the Dollar Tree, and the poofs were 10 inches. Okay, so we are done with the pink. Um, yes, I do, but not by much, Bev. Not by much. And I find that um, people that want wreaths that fit in um, between the, like the, the screen door. <gasps> oh, Darlene, no. Oh, I'm so sorry. My heart's dropped. Oh, I am so sorry. All three of them. Oh. oh my gosh, I just got the chills. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, that's terrible. They have to be devastated. I can't I can't even imagine. I'm so sorry. Ugh. Okay, so um what I'm gonna do now is I cut 10 inch mesh. I cut I, yeah, I can't even, I can't even imagine, Darlene. I really can't. That has to be devastating. So I cut 10-inch um, mesh, about 10 inches, in the yellow and the kind of, kind of blue. Oh, thanks, Katie. Katie made my apron. So I'm going to do, put two, one of each color in each of the I can't yeah I can't even imagine each in the full twist ties yeah that's terrible I, I truly can't even imagine that I'm so sorry for your family okay so it kind of looks you know funny with the colors but once we get the sign on there you'll see yeah, I can't even, I just, I can't even imagine that. Look how, you know, everyone must be feeling. 
Okay, let me grab my per dab. I'm gonna put that in there. Oh. Hey Rose, how's it going? Ay, 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 ay. Hey Cheryl. Yeah, we will definitely be praying for them because I can't. Oh, that is so sad. Hey Rose, I, I, yeah, I mean, I know people wait so long and then, um, you know, tragedies like that happen and I just, I can't even imagine what they're feeling. Just the devastation to lose all three of them. Ay, ay, ay. Can't, I just can't. Yeah, they had some sort of falling out. I don't know what it is, but um, yeah, he said he would never use one again. Hey, Peggy. Happy Valentine's Day. Hey, Joanne, how's it going? Yeah, we will definitely add your family to our prayers because I cannot even imagine that. Because that's what's going to get them through it. Oh, childish behavior, Laura? Yeah, I don't know. I kind of stay out of drama. I try not to get involved in drama. <laughs> so. Hey, I know. How are you, Peggy? I'm finally starting to feel better. Hopefully it'll stay that way. <clears throat> so I know these, these colors kind of look funky, but once we get um, the sign on there, it'll all kind of make more sense. So. I haven't done this technique in a long time, so I thought I would do it. Oh, I know. Me too, Peg. Whew. I've had enough of it. Enough, enough, enough. I was talking to my daughter-in-law and my grandkids today, and my son came home not feeling good, so Chris is sick. He said he had the chills and um, aches and stuff like that, so I don't know. Um, now, I don't have a video on placing the ribbons, but... As we go on, you'll see how I do it, Anita. So if you have any questions, just let me know. What I do on my um, work, my frames, is I put half pipe cleaners in certain spaces, and I just don't put streamers in there because I think it's too much. So, exactly, Cindy Lou. Um, no, Doris, not for this. The only thing I really use a wood burner on sometimes is when I do the, um, the flowers with mesh sometimes, but they it still frays. Your daughter's in the hospital, Donna? All right, so that's what the bottom looks like. All right, and we're going to add them to the top. And I'm just taking it and rolling them. And then putting that one there. I know. Yeah, I can't even imagine, Darlene. Yep, that's all you can be there and just pray for them because really that's the only thing that will get them through it. Oh, thanks, Christine. Uh, it does fray, Cheryl. Um, it's going to fray no matter what you do. Um, but this actually didn't fray too bad. And this is the basic mesh. So, but I'll show you, um, oh my goodness, with pneumonia. Oh, Donna. Poor thing. 
Hi, is it Maritza? That's a pretty name. Hi, Maritza. Welcome, welcome. If you guys could share this video with your friends, I would appreciate it. Yeah, there's a lot of that going on, Donna. There's so many sicknesses going around. That, um, and then you want to put the, the rolled edge, the rough edge on the back so it doesn't, so you don't see that fraying as much. <clears throat> hey, Joanne, how are you? Okay. Hey, Joanne, how are you? Thank you so much for sharing. I appreciate that. Like I said, if there's anyone new on here that does not get my alerts, just type live in the comments and then follow the directions that the bot tells you to do. If you don't follow the directions, you won't be, um, you, you will not be subscribed to it. I know a lot of people type in live and they don't follow the directions, so they're not in there. <clears throat> so again these are just cut to around you know 10 11 inches and then I just roll them yep just make sure you follow the directions that the bot is telling you um, so that you get thanks Dawn oh thank you Joan hey Sean how are you Thank you for sharing. Much appreciated. Hey, Rita from North Carolina. Hey, Nicole. Hey, Tequila. How's it going? All right. So I left it like that. And then um, what I wanted to do was show you guys how this mesh roller works, too. So I have my two rolls, my two colors on here. And then what you can do is you can pull them both at the same time, like that. And then I don't use this when I'm um, pulling the mesh, but I use this when I'm cutting it. So you just feed it under this roller and then pull it out. And then you want to use your, um, thank you, you want to use your rotary cutter. Get them lined up okay and then this just makes it so much easier to cut your mesh and that's all there is to it so that's why I love this mesh holder because really it just makes it so much easier hey Marianne how are you doing all right so last two these over here. I know, right? It's awesome. Whoop. I dropped my mesh. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be colorful. Oh, I put my thing holder over there. Oh, well. Okay, so. Last two again. You want the rough edge facing down so that you don't see the rough edge and it doesn't fray as much. So I'm going to place the last two in. Thank you. Same to you, Marianne. I know. I can't. I just can't. Hey, Rita. Yeah, I cut them around, I don't know, between 10 and 12 inches. Thanks, Nicole. Um, so Cute by Katie made it. She's on here, I think. So you guys can see my logo. Are you liking them? Yeah, So Cute by Katie made my apron, and it's awesome. And she was very quick, too. I know, right? I think Scott is, too. I don't know who else, but I don't know what she did. But like I said, I stay out of the drama. I stay out of it. Um... Craft Outlet, Trendy Tree, um, Deco Exchange, and what's the other one? Um, there's another one. What's the other one? Yeah, Try Deco Exchange. 
All right, so that is our base, okay? So we did, just to recap, we did the 10-inch poofs with the, uh, oh, no, you're not a downer, Darlene. Thanks for sharing that. So now we know we can, the wreath shop. Thank you, Stephanie. Um, and we know how to pray for you, right? Yeah, I stay out of the drama. Yes, thank you. All right, so that's the base, okay? And then, so you see how, how these colors are going to, um, you know, bring out the colors in the sign. Yeah, Sims Potter, you have to have a retail license for, though, like a wholesale license. All right, so I cut this mesh. Thanks, Kevin. Happy Valentine's Day to you. So I cut this. All right, has a lot of the colors of the sign. And then I'm thinking I'm going to go with these two with it. So we will see. All right, so let's see what it looks like. Okay, pull this over here. And then get this open. <clears throat> that one's already open. Okay, and I also use my mesh roller to cut my ribbon. That makes it easier. All right, I'm going to use my perfect tails. Hey, Rebecca, how are you? Perfect tails just kind of help you get... Um, okay, so I just line it up there and then just fold it over. Sherry, thank you. <laughs> you know what? I kind of just, I, I usually, yes, 14 inch tails. Yep. I usually try to be, I usually try to have this stuff done before I come on, but um, I wasn't sure. Yeah, this one is the 14 inch perfect tail. So it's the size of the, yeah, these came from um, perfect tails, the soul sisters. Thanks, Tequila. Um, so if you're interested in those, you can go into the soulsisters.com, I think it is, and order them. And they have all different colors. And then, whoops, my scissors got stuck. Um, they did special order yellow for me since, you know, live in the hive with the bees. So Amanda made them yellow for me. Okay, so there's those. Oh, look at that. I just had enough. All right, and then the last one here. I got these um, these two ribbons at AC Moore. So again, just line that up and then just roll it. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You know what? Like a like a, a mellower mesh. Yeah, um, that's hard to find. Hey, Jenny, how are you? Because they usually have bright meshes. Um, but you're right. Like a like a soft buttery yellow. Try, um, oh, you did? How do you like them, Jenny? Have you used them? Yeah, I was going to say Trendy Tree or, um, I know there's a jute mesh with two yellows. Oh, let me pull that out. I'll show you. Um, that I, it's not totally muted yellow, but it is, um, Yeah, try, uh, 
Now this is bright yellow too, but it has the kind of muted in the middle. Yeah. Um, so this is kind of, the muted yellow is hard to find, but this came from Craft, no, yeah, Craft Outlet has this. So it's a jute poly mesh, so maybe, you know, maybe that might work for what you're looking for, I don't know. Yeah, it does make it faster, it does make the cutter, cutting of the ribbon a little faster. So last one here. Okay. Done and done. Okay. So get that out of the way. So we'll see how this looks. Okay. So we have those two and this one. So we're going to put three. Yeah, it is. Um, hold on. It is www. Okay, there's their website if you um, want to buy from them there. Okay. It is for a bumblebee wreath for a baby's room. Yeah, well, hmm. you know, it's, it is hard to find that a pale yellow. I don't know that I've ever really seen a pale, pale yellow. It's usually the bright yellow. All right, so we're going to use these three. We're going to stack them on top of each other. Hey, Debbie, how are you? And then we're going to fold it in half, just like that. And then we're going to gather it together. Okay, and then we're going to put one in each of the full pipe cleaners. Okay. <clears throat> hey Janet all right so that's what the tails look like I think it's gonna match good it's got all the colors in it so we will just continue going around <laughs> that ribbon just wants to curl thanks Debbie Okay, Annette says she got a real pail from the wreath shop, she thinks. Yeah, sometimes there's some... Hey, BJ, how are you? Some um, colors are just harder to find than others. Thank you, Lori. So again, these are just cut to 14 inches. We're going to gather it together and put it in each of the ties. Thanks, Janet. Oh, okay. Karen says try iridescent yellow at Craft Outlet. Hey, Sandra, how are you? Okay. I know, aren't they bright? <laughs> it's very cheerful. Very cheerful. Old time pottery. Can you, um, the mesh... I did 10 inch poofs, BJ, and then I did um, about 10 to 12 inch curls. And then these I cut to 14 inches, the ribbon. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely a very colorful spring wreath. Spreading those out. Thank you. Same to you, Tequila. All right. Yes, very colorful. <laughs> You're welcome, BJ. Okay, so again, these are just cut to 14 inches. Oh, you were? Oh, thanks, Joanne. Yeah, it turned out really cute. I think my sister really loves it, so I just have to get it boxed up and, uh, um, you know, ready for her. 
Right, Cindy Lou? Exactly. Exactly. I do not. Just keep me out of it. <laughs> keep me out of it. Oh, no. Thanks, Doris. Yeah, I know. Facebook can be a real pain sometimes. But I think these... Um, hey, Rosalia. The colors... Hey, Pamela. Of the ribbon is kind of toning the mesh down a little bit. That's okay. Thank you, Carrie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, thanks, Pamela. Yeah, it's turning out cute. Turn on my glue gun here. I know they're really pretty, aren't they? Nice and springy. Springy, springy, springy. I know they do make you happy, don't they? They're nice and bright and cheerful. Put a little color into your life today, Darlene. Hopefully good good colors. Um, Melanie, yes, I put I put six of the um, full pipe cleaners in all around the top, and then on the bottom I put six full pipe cleaners and six half pipe cleaners and the half pipe cleaners I only put mesh in <clears throat> it's just kind of how I came up with it yeah they really do don't they Beth yeah Nice, bright, and cheerful, you know, for a, um, no problem for a dreary day. Although today wasn't bad. Today was kind of nice out. It was 48 degrees here today, actually. Like, yay, it finally got a little warm. So... Um, I got this from Michael's, Dawn. Yep, I just got it from Michael's. It's originally $50. It was on sale for $25. And I think, I don't, I think it might still be on sale. I think someone told me it was still on sale. And if it is still on sale, I think you can use, if you ever have a 20% off, um, you know, coupon, I think you can use that on that too, someone said. Thank you, Sue. Happy Valentine's Day to you as well. Fourteen inches of snow. Where do you live, Darlene? Wow. You live in Minnesota or something? I know my sister lives in Minnesota and they got a ton of snow. Yeah, we didn't get snow. Thank we got a little bit. We got probably got a couple inches, but it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all. Wow. Yeah, I'm glad we only got a little bit. Upstate New York. Oh, okay. <clears throat> no, thank you. Yeah, we didn't we didn't get a whole lot, so I was happy with that. Oh, thank you, Sonia. Same to you. Hey, Yvonne. Thanks, Linda. We are chugging right along here. Be on the lookout because I brought some ribbon home today. In the next day or so, 
I'm going to do a live showing you guys all the ribbon, new ribbon I got. So 50 yard rolls. Yay! Don't forget to share this with your friends if you would. Yeah, I made um, I made different ones for my um, Probo too. Oh, thanks, Dawn. I just like longer ones, so I made longer dowels for my um, Probo also. I know I love fifty-yard rolls, so. I have a couple of them up here, but I have most of them downstairs. But I just didn't, didn't have time today to get them. Um, <laughs> I know, Nicole. I didn't have enough time to get it all together from by the time I got home today and dinner with my hubby and that kind of stuff. So thanks, Rosalia. I like it, too. It's turned out really cute. Oh no, Darlene, that's not good. You probably got snow all in, on your feet. Last one here. Thank you, Yvonne. Thank you. Happy Valentine's to you as well. Okay, so last set of ribbon tails here. Okay. <clears throat> no, Cheryl, I'm so mad. I, they said they won't even probably won't even ship till the 15th. I know I'm like really if I had found other signs that I liked better, I would have just canceled my order because it really makes me mad. All right, so there it is. Hey Debbie, how are you? All right, so it all makes sense when you put the sign on. <laughs> okay. All right, so let's get um, the sign on. And then I have, I have some styrofoam. Thank you very much. Styrofoam eggs and then some little chicks. I don't know if I'm going to put the chicks in, but we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. We'll see. All right, so let's get the sign on. I didn't, I didn't do too bad. Although I brought home, like I was just telling them, I brought home a lot of ribbon for you guys um, that I have to get together yet. But I didn't do too bad. Alright, so I'm just going to cut two pieces of wire to go on my side. You think you think you yeah I like them too. Alright, so I'm just gonna wrap the wire around because this came with holes. So I'm gonna wrap the wire around. I know, aren't they cute, Joanne? I think I got I can't remember if I got them at Michaels or A Seymour or something like that. <clears throat> So there's one. Let's get the second one on here. Yeah, because the sign says, like, let me see, chocolate peeps, jelly beans, too. But hey, Kathy, how's it going? Did you get your craft room all done now? All right, so I think I'm just going to plop this right. In middle here the sign I sell this sign um, Nicole actually have one more of them yep it's in my Etsy shop it is um, $12 I think AC more you can buy um, online now I think Tie that in. I'm going to tie it onto 
the one cross frame so it doesn't slide around. Awesome, Kathy. So now you have to get making those wreaths. Got to get busy. Oh, you did? I know. I want to go to Big Lots. I have to go. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Day to you. Are they big ones or little ones? Hey, Nancy. All right. Let's put that one there. Let's get this one in. Okay. Six inches. I know someone said they found them at um, Party City, the um, peeps. So there's one not too far from here that I wanted to go to and check that out too. Again, I just put it around the crossbar so that the sign doesn't like slide from side to side. That's good. Okay. All right, so now let's fix this stuff out from underneath our sign here. Oh, yeah, you got to get on that. Oh, I know, right, Debbie? They have some good stuff. They really do. I, um, I really like it. most of the time. Hey, Jasmine. They're out already. I haven't been to the, the um, party city around here, so. Yes, yeah, I don't know if these are going to be too tiny or not, but we'll see. They do? You checked them out, Sandy? All right. Let me get my glue gun here. Put this stuff over here. You got yours there? I know. I wanted to get up there, and I still haven't gotten up there. Okay, so what I do with these eggs is I pull the little ribbon off and I put my glue gun here. Bye, Kathy. Have a good one. Happy thanks Thanksgiving. Happy Valentine's Day. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pipe cleaners. Oops, that came right out. Not tie very well. Whoops. Okay. Take my pipe cleaners. Yes, Joanne, I sure do. All right, so I'm going to take them and twist them together. And then I'm going to cut them off. Oh, okay. I haven't, I know, I want to get there. I want to see them. Okay, so then what I do is I push one of them down so that one's sticking straight up. And then the egg, I... Put the glue inside that hole right there. And then I stick this right onto that pipe cleaner. And that also helps to hold your streamers in place. Okay. So we will go around. Now, let me try one of these peeps and see what you guys think. So if I can get them open. Um, it's a uh, peeps. They sell like big cloth peeps at Party City. All right. I thought since they were all different colors, it would be cute to use them. So like, let's try a green one. I think so, Nicole. Yes, I think so. Well, thank you, Marlene. All right. So, whoops, here's a pink one. Okay. Maybe it'll work. Let's try it. Let's try it. All right, so what I'm going to do with that is I'm just, I just cut the pipe cleaners. Let me get these streamers the way I want them. Okay, and then I'm going to, what would, um, it depends where you buy them from, Linda. Every place is a little different. Um, it really it it really depends. Okay, so I'm gonna put that little chick right there. Let 
Yeah, it just kind of depends where you buy it from. I mean, now 10 yard, hey Brenda, 10 yard rolls of ribbon are still usually anywhere wholesale, like four to six dollars, even higher. It just depends where you get them from because every place is different. All right, then I'm going to take a purple one. And I just kind of put the um, ice pick in there to kind of make the hole bigger and so I can get more glue in there so it holds nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, if they get wet, um, yeah, that is, a, that is a problem if they're going to get wet, so... How oh, cute. Look at the little chick. I love it. Turned out cute. All right. Then maybe I'll use an orange one. So you just kind of want to get your tails out from under there again. I know. Aren't they adorable? I think it, I think it was either AC Moore or Michaels. I got the little chips. I can't. I, I want to say AC Moore. Okay, and then like I said, all I do is I get that pipe cleaner, kind of fold it over, and then I put the glue, you know, pretty decent amount right on there. And then I'm just going to put the little feet right in the glue and hold it in there till it sticks. I know, so cute. All right. Yeah, this one's kind of tucked in there. They are, they're, I don't know, they're kind of fuzzy. I don't know what they're made of, to be honest. I guess some sort of fabric or, it, you know, it, it, it's kind of like the same as the pipe cleaners. They're doing good. Thank you, Sandra. Yeah, it's kind of like the same material as the um, pipe cleaners are made out of. That's what it kind of feels like. Okay, so this one, I'm going to use a blue egg. So I'm just alternating the eggs and the chicks. Now this one's kind of really tucked in there, so. Pull that over there. Oh, thank you, Teresa. Yeah, it's turning out really cute. All right, and this one is a little chick, so we will use a green one. Thank you, Annette. Same to you. Okay, I'm just going to cut them off and get it so I can put some glue on there. Yeah, I think, I want to say these came from um, AC Moore, but I'm not 100% sure. Because a lot of times what I do is I'll get the stuff, like, you know, clearance at the end of the season. So I think I bought these last year. <laughs> I know the chicks are tiny, but they just kind of look like they're peeking out from the, from the um, mesh, doesn't it? They're cute. All right, so then I will just go around the bottom and do the same thing. Hey, Pat. Everyone loves your wreath, Pat. We'll use a yellow one here. Pat is my sister that I made the wreath for. The floral one in the back. I know, aren't they cute? There's a purple one here. Okay. And again, all I'm doing is, is I'm getting a piece of that pipe cleaner and putting hot glue on it and then putting the chick right on that to make it stick.
green here. Oh, wow. Um, I mean, your wholesale places, you're going to get the most savings. Um, like Sims Pottery and that kind of stuff. But um, their shipping is what kills you, too. Their shipping is ridiculous. Oh, the, the glue gun is a Black & Decker. I got, got it from Amazon. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. <clears throat> okay, so we're getting a chick here. Hey, Pat, thank you very much. You got your ribbon today? Or your, yeah, your ribbon today? So let's use let's see, a blue one. We haven't used a blue one yet. Okay, stick that chick right there. Um, I, I don't remember. I want to say around $79, Annette. I got it off of Amazon. You can probably look on there. Um, I want to say it was around $79. And then I did get an extra battery. And I would suggest if you get one to get an extra battery. Because then when one is charging, you know, the other one is on the gun. So I always have one charging. No problem. We got our last, uh oh, our chicks go. All right, we'll use a yellow one. Yeah, these chicks are really cute. Okay. Last one here. I love these little chicks. They are adorable. Adorable, adorable, adorable. Okay. All right. Okay. What do you think? Think it needs a bow, or are we good with just this? I don't know. I like it. What do you guys think? Oh, Joanne, I think this is going on my third year, and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. It is very addicting. Um, you definitely get addicted to it. It's... Um, Yep, no bow. I know. I think so, too. I think so, too. Yeah, now you see how the colors make sense with the yellow and the green now, once with the pink, because it's got all the colors in there of the sign. So I think it turned out cute. So I was playing around with this last night. Have any of you guys made any of the tobacco baskets? Hey! So I made this last night, but isn't that cute? Thank you. Yeah, I think so. I think it turned out cute. So I'll show you some of the ribbons that I got today. I don't have all of them up here, but um, look at these. Aren't these adorable? I love these. This one. And then I got some daisy stuff, but that's downstairs too. So this is some of the ribbons that I'm going to be offering. Um, I just have to get everything together and work on it. Hey, Carl, thank you. So 
And then I have two and a half of a bunch of colors, new colors in the linen. The um, purple or the lavender, a fuchsia, a pink, a lime green, um, two different blues. So, what do you mean you just can't win, Linda? <laughs> I'm confused. Yeah, I did. I made it last night. I was just kind of practicing with it. And I think it turned out cute. So I think we're going to, I'm going to do this in group. One of my, one of my uh, group nights, we're going to do this. And I also want, to, <laughs> I know, Nicole, trust me, my bank account's killing me too. Um, I got the baskets at um, AC Moore. The small ones were on sale for $5. And then I got some bigger ones. They were on sale for $10. So I know, aren't these adorable? I haven't priced this out yet. Joanne, I don't know, but I was just playing with that one to see how it um, would come out, and I really like it, because the little ones, you can't really put, like, a bow and stuff like that, it's just, I don't know, so I think it turned out cute, so I was working on that, so, um, yeah, I'll, I'll get that, I'll get that listed in my Etsy shop, all right, guys, that's it for tonight, here's my Easter I do have one of these signs left if anybody is interested in that sign, but I have other ones, um, other signs in there too. So I think it turned out, I love the little chicks. Look at the little chick just peeking out, just peeking out under there. Like it's hiding it's under, like it kind of reminds me like a chick hiding under, um, under its mom, you know? <laughs> All right, guys. Well, you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day. Thank you for joining me. I appreciate it. And we will see you guys. Like I said, I'm going to try and do a live tomorrow to get the ribbons going. And um, if not, I will see you guys on Monday night. Thanks so much. Yes, you will definitely be learning. Yep, yep. So... Yeah, so I think that, and I have a um, uh, another thing I'm going to do in my group is a tulip carrot. So we have a couple things that I really want to do in there. So if you guys are interested in the group, just type in group, and I would love to have you in there. All right, thanks so much, guys. Have a wonderful evening. See ya. Oh, thank you, Joanne.